I always kind of looked at them as not necessarily pride in, in, in what they represented, but just that that's part of my city. That's kind of part of who we are. But part of New Orleans is also that it, it changes, you know, like every city. So I think this is kind of a step in the, in the right direction. All right, you don't put a swastika up by mistake. You don't put a rebel flag up by mistake. There are direct intentions behind that, rooted in very old traditions and very old history that always allocates itself back to the enslavement of my ancestors. Yeah, I'm here to defend my heritage. These are my, uh, my ancestors. When you try to explain to them about it, all they want to spout out to you is that you're a racist. It does, because we're not a racist. It doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't. Why is it coming down? It extends beyond racism. A lot of these people, even on the other side of those barricades, they want things to stay the same. Do we want to have monuments tell our history? We either need to reinterpret them somehow or acknowledge that that story is going to be told by the people who created those monuments.